Hello friend, in this video lecture I am going to discuss about how to perform some of first and last digit inside to sysop.net. So this code that I already written to save sometimes. So now I am going to explain this code. So add here when you debug or run the code then first control comes to main method. Here after that go inside. So here I have taken integer type variable n. And here after console dot write line, so this will display into the output screen, and uh, whatever we enter first, so that accept into a string format. So here console dot read line, so that read here you can see a string read the next character from the standard input. So this read into the string format, and after applying in dot parse that convert into integer, and next that go to n. So suppose if we enter at this place 567. Now here n value is now 567. Now 1 n. So n is now 567. So here n. So this place n is now 567. Now when con control comes to this uh, or this place, then that call fun method. Here after that go to this place and uh, here at this location that uh, num receive 567 so num value is now 567 here after that go inside so here l s t d num mod 10 so num mod operator that to uh, return remainder so here uh, num is now 567 mod 10 so if you do this then the value comes 7 because mod operator that return remainder 7 now here after num value go to uh, here frstd so num is now so this place num value is now 567 so frstd equal to 567 now here after 567 greater than equal to or 10 that condition is true so this place 567 greater than equal to 10 the condition is true then that go inside so here fr std equal to fr std divide by 10 so here 567 when you do the division the value comes 56 now while loop continue control comes to this point now here that check 5 6 greater than equal to 10 condition true then that go inside so here 5 6 divide by 10 so it divide by 5 times so it divide by 5 times now here after that go up and here uh, this is now 5 greater than equal to 10 condition is false so then that comes to this point so here fr std the value come 5 5 and here lstd so lstd the value is now 7 so 7 plus 5 that is 12 now here after uh, that return 12 here after or this method uh, part that has completed here after control back to this point so I enter n 567 now this value is now at this place that return 12 and sum become 12 here after console dot right line the sum of first and last digit equal to 12 that display so here 7 plus 5 12 now let's uh, run and check the output so at this place you can uh, enter any kind of value and uh, this uh, I am using fun method because uh, if you separate the code on the method so it's uh, very easy to understand the codes and uh, in this uh, program the logic e logic about uh, mod operator and division operator so mod operator that written remainder and division operator that return cursant 
and uh, here this is the while loop concept so when the while loop continue then that continue on when that falls then that comes to return so let's enter 567 now here you can see the output it's uh, displaying 12 now let's so uh, you can enter any kind of digit this places so here we can enter so 567899 9 plus 6 it's now 15 if you enter single digit number number must be positive okay you should enter any positive number so if you enter 0 0 is a non positive non negative so it's uh, returning 0 only and uh, here when you enter any single digit number so first and last digit so the sum of first and last digit equal to 8 so first digit that written 8 last digit is also 8 so 8 plus 8 6 and uh, here when I enter two, city, 2 digit number so 1 2 so 1 plus 2 that is 3 so this is the code that's so working fine so this is the way we can do sum of first and last digit inside uh, csrp.net so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you